so in this tutorial we will uh, going to learn how to create a 3d class in autocad so once it is created it should look like this so we will apply the glass material also to the glass and we will create a background and bottom surface also so that it can be presented properly so let's start with autocad so at first we have to we will go to right plane so we will choose your right so we'll work, work on the right we don't want to use just in the middle so we will say uses icon no region then we will create a profile and then revolve it so let's create a profile take arc three point arc first point second point third point so this first profile is ready so in the corner we want one more profile so again we will take arc then first point second point and third point at the end escape so this is top profile is ready now in the bottom we will put a vertical line here so we will take a line so here we will put a vertical line make a fit ortho on then from here we will make a inclined line so we will create a inclined line from here and then one horizontal line so this will be the bottom and this is the center line of the glass now we will connect this using a fillet so just a fillet then right click radius take some radius suppose i will take this much is the radius then first first object second object so fillet radius this is my radius first okay there is some problem for plate we will just extend it so just take extend extend so up to this i want to extend enter okay extend and just trim the unwanted shape so this has been trimmed so now i want to connect this to using p edit so i will just say p edit yes join this arc enter escape then i will offset this offset by some small distance suppose 0.1 then i will offset it inside okay then at the corner i will create a two point circle so i will say circle two point then first point second point then i will trim this unwanted shape unwanted arc after that now i have to connect here so here also i will use arc arc end point of this make ortho off and and i will take the nearest point nearest okay so i will then connect it using p edit so uh, just trim this unwanted line trim okay now just connect this using p edit so that we will form a single continuous line polyline join select all enter escape so this has been formed properly we'll switch to south east isometric view so this profile is ready now we will revolve this profile using revolve command so we'll just say revolve select object enter so around this line we want to revolve center line in 360 degree so this our glass is ready we can see it in conceptual visual style so in this way the glass is ready now we want to apply material and see how it look like 
so before applying material we will just create a scene around so just at the bottom we will create one circle so it will form as a bottom surface so we just have to change the view to view then you see us top we want to work on top then create a circle with bottom center a larger circle okay now we will uh, convert this circle into a region so we will just say region so home draw region select the circle enter so it has been converted into region and some background uh, surface is needed so we will just create one arc just say arc then give the three points this is first point this is second quadrant point then this is third quadrant here on this side so this arc is ready then we will extrude that arc using extrude command so we will just say extrude then select the object to extrude last enter give the height how much height you want so we will creating a background so we are given the height okay now we will apply material to this just orbit it so that we can view the proper shape okay now just zoom it and then select the material you want to apply so here okay so we want to apply a glass so from here we will choose a glass suppose we go to door and window material so here plain glass clear glass is there just say uh, click on glass material then click on the glass we created and just enter so you can see how it little look like by going to render tab and click here and say material and texture on so it has become transparent so same way we will apply the flooring also suppose so we will we will just again click here we will take flooring material samples so i want a finishes suppose i want this one cork at the bottom escape and then i want suppose this bamboo for the vertical surface so in this way this is ready then we can see how it look like by pressing on render just say render so it will create the image for us So in, the, in this way it has created